Welcome to another episode of Curtis Goes Wild. <laughs> Today we're heading up the Clyde Valley, this way, to McCoy Hut and uh, spending the night there. It's a long weekend, Waitangi weekend. And the next night we'll head up uh, Lawrence, the Lawrence River there to Lawrence Hut. This is our first crossing of the Clyde River. Uh, it's probably the deepest part and we all crossed over nice and safely and headed up the valley. As you can see, sort of up around my top pocket there. Yeah, that's what we call protection. Yeah, from him. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't like to be the four wheel driver that's stuck under that rock pile. <laughs> it slipped down at some stage. <laughs> John, what are you doing? Wrecking it deep enough for my feet because it's freaking useless. But why, John? Because I'm hot. So okay. Hot right now. I'd say you're probably more of a four out of ten. <laughs> no. <laughs> I, I noticed his partner here cracking up laughing because she's like more like three and a half. <laughs> Lunch break. <laughs> yep. <laughs> what a bummer, I just dropped my inReach and cracked the screen, so now the top two thirds of the screen don't work. But you gotta love the country we live in. We have to get that fixed. Mmm, not good. Tamara looks deep already. Right, uh, watchdog hut just ahead of us here. Nice tidy looking six bunker this one. Came down to the river, had a dip. It's cold, glacial, as you can see up there. <laughs> Who are these Hello. fresh clean looking people? We've come to crash the party. Oh. Lucky you brought party mix. <laughs> <laughs> Sunday morning and we're off to go and bag McCoy Hut. Final approach up to uh, McCoy Hut just up there. Looks like we probably made the right choice last night staying at Watchdog because uh, there's a few people with tents out here. Either they didn't stay in the hut or the hut was full. After a brief walk up to McCoy Hut and back down to Watchdog to pack up, we're now heading down uh, the Clyde Valley here and we're going to be left up that way to Lawrence Hut for tonight's uh, accommodation. Wow, it's just been cut off the edge by the looks of it over a long period of time. Clyde Hut behind us, these uh, lovely people made us all a coffee. Um, <laughs> So we stopped here for lunch and had a nice real coffee with real milk. Awesome little spot, very hospitable. Well, we've got the uh, horses here on the Irwin station. Apparently they like to be patted. After briefly patting the horses, we then continued up the Lawrence River. You couldn't have asked for a nicer day than this one. Night two's accommodation, Lawrence Hut. The views around here. So I've decided Lawrence Hut's one of the best huts ever. Uh, one of the main reasons is I've been left some little treats, uh, some spades, and uh, yeah, thank you. Here, yeah. inside the Lawrence Hut. Breakfast with Antonia. How's breakfast? Terrible. The chef was just so bad. Tomorrow cooked. <laughs> Monday morning and we're about to leave Lawrence. Great hut to stay the night at. Awesome hut. Hello. Hi. <laughs>
three days up the Clyde um, mission accomplished although there's still a couple of huts I've got to come back for that I didn't manage to bag this time um, but that's just going to be another weekend trip some stage soon thanks for watching